We have coats. This has to be little mama's right here. Is this your coat? <laughs> this car right here? It's a really good thing that he's doing this. I mean, there's families here and everywhere that need jackets, you know, just not everybody can get them. I definitely care, you know, I care about, about others. I care about, you know, the people around me. I care about my family. I care about a lot of people. And uh, like, I, like I said before, you know, I just, I just want to, you know, help, help people out because I'm fortunate enough to, you know, you know, be wearing a coat or, or eating and, and, and sitting in a, in a nice, you know, house where I can be warm. I bought the coats and, uh, you know, I, I gave them to people and, you know, now they can be warm and, and, and you know, yeah, have you, a coat for school. Can, I think it's awesome. He is one of those kids who has uh, had big dreams and uh, he went right from high school to play baseball. And he's one of those people, people who never forgets who he is. Mm -hmm. It hasn't changed him any. Mm -hmm. So he's still the same old man and uh, loves people and is quick to say hi to people and anybody mm -hmm. who needs help. And he, I'm sure he helps his parents a lot and uh, he loves all kinds of kids. You know, one of the, the moms said, now you can go, go to, to, to school, uh, wait at the bus stop with a coat on. And just for her to even say that was, you know, for me, it was it was it was it was it was heartbreaking because I just don't feel like people should, you know, I think everybody should, you know, be able to, to eat food and have clothes and coats and, and warm places to stay. But, uh, you know, it actually, you know, to put a smile on, on family's faces and to see the parents and, and the kids react the way they reacted was, was definitely uh, good for me and very humbling.